Here at Zion, I can tell you that uh, match four was comfortably won in the end by Team Abu Dhabi, who posted 132 for five, thanks to Livington 68. And then in reply, the Warriors got to Nelson, 111 for seven. And uh, Powell, 42, was the top score. Abu Dhabi won by 21 runs. Sagarika is downstairs with a post-match presentation. As he prefers, Dwayne Bravo, who's got a wealth of knowledge on the bowling side of things, and that's going to be matched against a fine play on the batting side of things. Faf Duplessy, the captain. Yeah, a bit of swing. That shape in has been so effective in white ball cricket. Left armers, especially with the new ball. But pulled away, leg side timing. That last ball disappears to the fence. The first over done it, seven without loss. That's a great catch. Rutherford settled underneath that. Faruqi with the wicket. Well, bravo. Going with another left arm seamer for today's game at the expense of Ram Paul. This catch by Rutherford might be a Dream 11 game changer. Who knows? Took his time, kept his eyes on the ball. And then when he knew he had it, cushion that catch with the ball. Straight away, success for the newcomer. In yeah! Bowling, the Yorker. And Faruqi is on a roll. Left arm pace is the way to go. The plus he goes. Haven't seen many of uh, that type of delivery throughout the day. But it is such an effective ball in any type of cricket. You nail a Yorker, you give yourself. A wonderful over, just two off, it's eight for two. And moves over and thrashes the leg side, straight to the man. Riley Russo with the catch, third wicket down. Well, the investment in an attacking bowler by Dwayne Bravo paying dividends, clear plans to go very hard with the ball against this opposition. It was a slip in place as well, which shows the mindset of the captain and the team. And it pays dividends. First wicket to Adil Rashid. One, one. Yeah, the googly into the offside, just a single. It's been a stranglehold straight away. Three wickets. For Bravo's side winning that title. Finally, one hit down the ground and finds the fence. It's Johnson Charles. Still learning his art as an all-rounder. Just over pitching in the slot. Johnson Charles wouldn't miss out. Give it the full face of the bat. Short again this time offside, straight to the man, another one down. Everything that Bangla Tigers hit in the air is going to the fielders. Well, he got away in the previous delivery. Jax was uh, aiming for the boundary, maybe looking for the elevation to go all the way for six. Not enough power, not enough. Down the leg side again. Fair time and best of luck for the rest of the innings. Thank you very much. All right, no and Ali Rashid with that googly. He strikes again. Johnson Charles trying to run this down to third man. He just kept back in and kept on going. Hits the off stump. A bit, a bit of uh, Romario Shepard who bowls a rather heavy delivery.
Into a pocket, thinking of two. Oh, full toss. You can't miss those, Benny. And he said he couldn't see it. A Benny Hill moment. <laughs> well, that was a 24-yarder slower ball. That was, a, that was an interesting delivery. Let's have another look at that. I think just there, just manages to dip on the batsman. And he sort of gestures afterwards. He can't see it. Well, if you can't see it, you can't hit it, Danny. <laughs> Well, he's smart bowling, isn't he? We've seen a couple of his bowls, but there's 24 yarders way back. And there's a dip and a drop on him. Oh, his cries a catch it. Can do. Oh, no. Dwayne, the DJ, the captain. You do not see that man on your screen drop many catches. He's an outstanding fielder. Tell you what, that nearly stuck in as well. One night. About 2013, but it's a while ago now. Well, he's underway now with a boundary. Yeah, a little bit of luck. He went, got through the shot a little bit too soon. Just manages to get that wrist in action, roll the ball over. Gets it past the man at 45. Well, they all count at this stage. A welcome boundary of the Tigers. Rata Rabins got 78. Well, that sounded good. Really good. Oh, just enough in the end. But off the blade, it was, thought it was always going for maximum. Yeah, that's a high quality, quality shot there by Udana. Halfway down the wicket, we saw it early. And a nice clean strike off the bat. Just manages to get, get it over. And six more. Talk about a thick edge. Back with a point. Well, look at that. I'm not sure how he's managed to get him for six over point. He certainly swung himself off his feet. Manages to just open the blade on contact. And cheerio. Bit of rejoicing here. I've got to say a few more numbers. Well, that was on the money. Not sure how the batsman or the keeper have missed it. It's, uh, Romanula. Gloves on. Can't get a glove on it. Yeah, I think he missed his run slightly there, I suppose. But oh, has he got just a little tickle on it? Is he a bit of, is there a bit of pad inside edge? Gone for four, but oh. So lucky. Like that. There you go. A little freebie on his knees. Just manages to hoik it. Just behind square. A welcome boundary for the Tigers. Yeah, served up. I mean, mentioning he's uh, missing his rhythm, missing his run up here, Romario. Shepard. Yeah, it's just too simple. I'm delighted. Good bowling as well. Like that. It is uh, right on the money. Shiraz, get a Yorker in, please. Left arm round. No, he's unlucky. He gets the Yorker and it's a bottom edge. The sixth lowest total ever in T10s. But it is a boundary. And they get to 69 for six, courtesy of a Q ender. Well, they all count, Danny. Doesn't matter how you get them. Welcome four runs for the Bangladesh Tigers. Shiraz, a bit disappointed how he finished there. However, Captain Bravo will be over the moon by restricting them for 69. We'll have a bowl first, thanks. That's a very sorry looking scorecard. Look at that. Look at the top five or six jokers. Played like jokers. Yudana, 21, and Faulkner, 19. That partnership, 41. Welcome back here to Abu Dhabi. The Delhi Bulls are on fire. 1-1 yesterday. They're restricted. 
the Bangla Tigers to 69 for six in their 10 overs. Easily the lowest score of the tournament this year. The Delhi Bulls absolutely on fire all over. The Bangla Tigers in this game there, the bowling figures stand up, take a bow. Adil Rashid, two for six from two. Didn't see him bowl yesterday. Oh, like a genius today. Faruqi, two for eight from two as well. Well played, young man, well played indeed. A wicket for Drakes and Shepard. Shiraz, the odd man out. He went wicketless, but he bowled nicely. Interesting start. Wide down the leg side, but good swing, Danny. Oh, and he's gone! So they called for early wickets to Bangla Tigers. Luke Wood. Swung one into the pads, and Gerbaz has suffered from having the microchip in his bat. That's two matches in a row. The guy with the microchip's been out. Second ball. This time flicks it straight to short fine leg. Good sharp catch. In the faces of the Bangla Tigers say it all. Yeah, there's a swing into the pads. And Mumanullah, oh dear, he's picked out the man around the corner. And uh, Yudana gleefully accepts this one. Oh, you'd probably think 99 times out of 100 that's going to find the gap or go over the man, pace on the ball. Oh, that's beautifully played. Swung into the pads just as the bowler was starting to get excited. Hafiz makes the adjustment, chips it back over the top. Four runs. Well, he's played here for many a year as Mohamed Hafiz at the Zion. Get into there on that sort of length, well, it's just too easy. As you say, Danny's been playing here at the Zayed for a long, long time. And Rousseau straight away down the wicket, he's gone for the big hit, but there's a man underneath it. Oh, no, 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 he's dropped it on the boundary. Made good ground, got underneath it. Right off the bottom of the bat from Rousseau, did everything right, apart from the obvious. Thank you, Will Jacks. I want to see some entertainment from Riley. Oh, he's giving him another go. This is high again. Who's going to catch this one? Yes, he's gone. The Delhi Bulls only chasing a small total. Rousseau showed his hand. He was going to go after it. Got away with that one, swinging into the pads. Oh, what a great effort! Put down by Benny Howell in the covers. Brilliant effort, diving away to his right. That would have been the third wicket. Instead, that's two overs gone, ten for two. There's that back of the hand. Brilliant slow ball. Benny, come on! take those brother but like you're batting <laughs> we lost the ball and lost his poles yeah smashed over the offside this is more like it that's gone all the way that's a maximum well speaking of brian charles lara this was very lara-esque gorgeous stroke from rutherford it's a slow one sure but you gotta wait for it the timing was exquisite had to wait for it and then there, yeah, said, look, I picked it. Thank you, Yadana. Yeah, Delhi Bulls need 53 from 46. That should be fairly straightforward. Oh, and here we go again, down the ground. Has he got everything? Yes, he has. That's another straight six from Shafane Rutherford. He's not messing around. He's got a taxi waiting out the back for him. He might bumble start the car because uh, this man's in the mood and he just gets it and goes wallop well could this be a rario moment you can now own your favorite cricket moments from rario.com adt10's official nft partner oh this one smashed down the ground there is a long on he dives across but he can't get there great effort from luke wood just couldn't quite get there, was hit with too much power by the Rutherford. And he's certainly, uh, with his timing together here, would have just closed the face on it fractionally, in terms of that timing, but got enough of it, and it did zip away across the turf here at Zion. 
Oh, this is high, full toss, miss it down the ground. Probably only going to get one. No, that's fine. Let's see how high this bad boy is. Oh, you make your own mind up. The bowler in me says, nah, that's all right. Uh, fair delivery comes a call from third umpire in my ear. Got away with one, slipped out the top. Here we go, this is another full toss, he's going to be caught in the deep. He is indeed. If at first you don't succeed, try, try again. Hafiz with a ball he could have hit anywhere in Abu Dhabi has picked out Benny Howell in the deep. Much to the disgust of the coaching staff. Ah, oh, one of the old guns. Here's a freebie. Well, Benny gets his uh, hands around this one. Still got talent, plenty in there. Oh, another full toss. This time hit over the offside. Surely this one will go to the boundary. Can't keep getting away with them. Yeah, four runs. Oh, Tommy Hartley. You say, Graham Swan, you can't keep bowling here. And Rutherford does not miss out. I was about to say, it might be a new tactic. No one expects it. Now in T10. Yeah. Hartley's oh, gone! Oh, he should have had another one. And another full toss, this one flicks over the leg side. So one of the more bizarre overs I've ever witnessed. Ends in favour of the Bulls, 39 for three from four. Yeah, crazy. I've seen some drops, this in, out, hit him high on the hand. Mr Wood. Oh, Lucas, and then this. Bizarre, bizarre over. Yeah, it's never a good time to lose games of cricket. Oh, it's never a good time to lose your wicket either. The Shafane Rutherford has gone for a mighty heave-ho over deep mid-wicket. James Faulkner, the canny old operator, strikes again. And as we've seen throughout this tournament, you bowl a straight line. If you're a spinner or if you're a fast bowler and you get rewards, if the batsman misses, you hit the target. As did Jim Spockner. For his second over. Yep. Probably get two here. Tricky chase. And he started with the four, straight down the ground. Owen Morgan, beautifully struck. Two captains at the crease with a lot of experience. Owen Morgan, Dwayne Bravo. And they know exactly how to assess the situation, which is an easy one. Not going to muck around. Full toss, pump down the ground, gets him four. That's beautiful. This one's not hit at all. Will they get two? No, Faf de Plessis quickly in, along on boundary. Oh, this one pulled away. Is there a man underneath it? No, it's gone all the way. Owen Morgan gets the umpires to raise his arms. Smoked it indeed. His throw brings uh, the Delhi Bulls within four runs of a victory. Owen Morgan picked his spot. Got it all the way for six. Yeah, just four runs required now from 13 balls. Lovely little knock for Owen Morgan's confidence. They've enjoyed this. Flicked away. And very skillfully played. Owen Morgan opens the face, runs it away for four. The Delhi Bulls complete their second victory in two days. They beat the Bangla Tigers here in Abu Dhabi by six wickets. And that has been a very comprehensive display indeed. Let's see the fireworks fly into the air as the Delhi Bulls 
complete a comprehensive victory over the Bangla Tigers. Bangla Tigers, even. They win by six wickets. So as we see the beautiful pictures from the drive.